everyone welcome to sus cookbook channel how are y'all hope all of you are doing well over here i'm fine thank you today i'll be cooking something special something that was taught by my mom it is minced mutton fried rice so it's actually an all-time favorite in my family and i hope that you will be enjoying this recipe too so let's check what the ingredients are and get started stay tuned till the end yeah so here are the ingredients for the minced mutton fried rice here I have about one bowl of rice 150 grams of minced mutton one heaped teaspoon of garlic ginger paste half teaspoon of chicken stock powder soy sauce light soy sauce thick soy sauce it is dark thick soy sauce I mixed a little bit with sweet dark soy sauce Ketchup manis as well. Okay, salt, black pepper powder, some mixed vegetable, green and red bird's eye chili, some fresh red chili, about eight shallots sliced thinly, half capsicum, some dry spices, two star anise, one small cinnamon stick, about three cloves. A little bit water, oil, one egg which I will scramble. For garnishing, I have some mint leaves and spring onion, coriander and Chinese parsley. I mix these four together. You may just use what you have at home. And here I have about one heaped tablespoon of meat curry powder and one heaped teaspoon of chili powder. You can decide how much you want to use. So let's get started. Heat up the wok over medium flame first. And I'm going to scramble the egg. Just a little oil. Okay, I'm using only one egg. If you want more, go ahead. Just going to soft scramble it and set it aside. oil about two tablespoons add in the dry spices star anise cinnamon and cloves shallots if you don't have shallots you may just use red onion turn the flame to medium high add in the ginger garlic paste just saute till the raw smell goes off then add in the minced mutton. Here yeah, I am using about 150 grams. You may use more or you may use less. Because once you cook, it will become very little. Lower the flame to medium low now. Allow the meat to cook thoroughly. Sprinkle a little water. Some salt, just a little bit since I'm using soy sauce and so you have to be careful with the amount of sauce, uh, salt that you are using. Chili powder, about one heap teaspoon and curry powder one tablespoon. Just going to use a bit first. All this you can adjust according to your preferred amount. Allow this to cook for a few minutes and until the oil separates. It's about 5-6 minutes now. I'm cooking this over medium low heat. And the meat is uh, fully cooked. At this point, I would like to add the frozen vegetables. and also the chicken stock powder. This is optional. If you do not want to add the stock powder, it's fine. 
ready to add the remaining curry powder. When you're cooking the meat, uh, just remember in between you just need to sprinkle a little water. So it's just to keep the meat moist. Add in the capsicum and the cut chilies, red and green, and add in the rice. If you do not want to use uh, minced mutton, then you may use minced chicken. Use the same recipe, but use uh, minced chicken instead. Just sprinkle a little water, very little. Uh. Increase the flame to medium now. Add in the light soy sauce, just a little bit at a time first. And the dark soy sauce. need to check the taste first to ensure that the seasoning and saltiness is enough before adding more. I'm going to add more of the dark soy sauce and the light soy sauce. We have chili protein, our black pepper. Bring down the flame to medium low again. Put in the fresh Take those in. And it's done. So this is a very quick recipe. Less than 20 minutes. So do try this. So I'm going to turn off the flame now. And so.